For most of us, going fishing is an activity that happens with little to no interruption. But for one Georgia man, it's repeatedly been the opposite. When someone comes and like purposely put their nose in my business or bother me while I'm doing something I ha I'm at peace with, it's very, very bothersome. It's irritating, but I try to stay as calm as I can because I don't want to escalate the situation. Anthony Gibson is a fisherman and actor. He recalls his first time fishing being when he was eight years old, when his uncle began taking him in a family full of non-fishing people. He says continuing with the tradition of heading to the lake brings him peace, but living in a predominantly white and wealthy neighborhood makes the activity much different from what he recalls as a child. He says on more than one occasion has he been approached, questioned. Do you guys residents here? Well, I asked you earlier, you didn't say where do you live? or even harassed while just trying to enjoy himself. Because some people ask, how did you know this was going to happen? How did you record? It's because it happened so often. So much so, he's been able to document many of these unusually curious people on his social media pages. I could tell when someone's being nosy. I'm a people person. I was a teacher for seven years. Like I said, I was an athlete. Um, uh, I'm an actor. He says despite how exhausting and frustrating this all is, as a Christian, he's forgiving and would even be open to sitting down with some of these people so he can see from their perspective and they can see from his. I would like to have a sit down with the lady they call Karen. You know what I'm saying? Um, I don't know how we're going to do it, but I would like to have a sit down with her. And if she would like to explain, and we could record this, and explain to everyone why she felt the need that she could just come up there. Now, despite not appearing to receive equal treatment himself, Gibson tells me he's a man of equality. And on top of that, he's now going to continue with his tradition while also pursuing roles as an actor. Reporting in Toledo, I'm Jaden Jefferson.